Today, we will be discussing the National Transport Authority's Greater Dublin Area Transport Strategy of 2022 to 2042. For some greater context on public transit in the area, Dublin is served by the Dublin Area Rapid Transit Train Service, DART, LUAS, the tram service, and a bus network. The transport strategy is based on national policies on sustainability, including a goal of an emissions reduction of 51% by 2030 as part of the Climate Action and Low Carbon Development Act. This goal is particularly challenging because of Dublin's historical development patterns, with most of the development being low density on the periphery of the city. The overarching goal of this plan is to provide a sustainable, accessible, and effective transport system for the greater Dublin area, which meets the region's climate change requirements, serves the needs of urban and rural communities, and supports the regional economy. Within this goal, there are four main objectives, an enhanced natural and built environment, connected communities and better quality of life, a strong and sustainable economy, and an inclusive transportation system. Dublin's transportation plan is driven by goals of reducing private car use by increasing walking, cycling, and public transit use, which are reflected in the proposed projects. The plan aims to create safer, more connected walking and cycling networks, and infrastructure priorities include increasing traffic-free streets, improving footpaths and connections, increasing separated bike lanes from 10 to 310 kilometers. In terms of public transit, the Dublin bus system will be overhauled by the new Bus Connects network, which will build 230 kilometers of dedicated bus lanes along 12 core corridors. The Lewis network will be expanded to build four new lines connecting the towns of Finglas, Lucan, Poolbeg, and Vrij to Dublin. The Dart Plus network will increase from 50 kilometers to 150 kilometers through four new lines. And lastly, an underground metro railway will be built connecting northern suburb Swords to Charlemont. This 19 kilometer route will operate at a three minute frequency. Dublin's transportation plan heavily integrates land use policies to manage travel demand in multiple ways, including supporting the development of housing to maximize the number of people able to travel by active modes, consolidating development to reduce sprawl and long distance travel, as well as facilitating transit oriented development through public transportation that supports high density and mixed uses. In terms of equity considerations, the plan says it's undergoing an equality impact assessment, but no further details are provided on the metrics and methods used, nor is a clear completion date given. While the strategy outlines ambitious outcomes in their mode split and accessibility measures, such as increasing access to jobs for those living in disadvantaged areas, there are no other significant performance measures to evaluate the success of interventions and policies. In conclusion, Dublin's transportation strategy is used as a tool to meet Ireland's climate goals, heavily integrates land use, and has few performance measures.